Hey, what is up, guys? Zach here. Welcome back to another episode of our Road to 1 Million Board Sales series. When we left off, I think we were at about 800,000 something board sales. I think it was like 850. We were getting really, really close, but we're going to check our progress in one second. I just need to warm up a little bit. Let's see. We are at, we're at 920,000 board sales. We are 80,000 away from finishing this series. I'm sure I'll figure out something to do afterwards just to keep it fun and exciting, but for now our goal is still a million board sales. So, 80,000 away. Could it happen this episode? Yes, it could happen this episode. Will it? I don't know. We're going to have to do a lot of challenges. We'll see. The goal is to, you know, we'll just, we'll just play it. We'll play it by ear. There's nothing down here. I thought that was going to lead to something. It really didn't. But anyways, we need to get some more board sales. Maybe we'll get there today. Maybe we won't. I'm going to leave you guys in suspense. You'll never really know. But anyways, we need a trick of the episode. And I saw a comment that said hippie jump. Someone wants the hippie jump to be the trick of the episode. So <laughs> there you go. The hippie jump. We're going to make hippie jump the trick. It'll be a fun one. Uh, let's see. Maybe just hop up here. Do like a... 360 hippie jump. Okay, almost. I know it's possible to do a 360. You just kind of have to get some air. You can also do a 540 at very specific spots, but that was not a good one. Let's see. If we... Do you think we can hippie jump something this big? Definitely not, right? Yeah, no way. Okay, well, we've already done this spot as well. Uh, let's see. I want to get in one good hippie jump before we end this. Maybe right here? Nope. <laughs> you can't go too high either. Oh, this might be a good spot to do a 360. Oh, there it is. Hippie Jump 360. It looked a little bit weird, but in the end, we got it out. Let's do this photo op. I don't actually know what this Yo, is. What tunnel blasting. Sounds easy enough. Air through the tunnel. Or 360 one-foot air. Does that mean like an ollie north or like a, a one f like oh, that's a no foot air? Never mind. Okay, so like an so like a an ollie north basically. I think that's got what it's it? called. I don't really know. Yo, you got what it takes. Basically, you just need to stick crazy. your front foot out. So I think we can probably do that. Uh, we just need to press the A button, I'm pretty sure. Let's find out. But I also need to do a 360. I think I can do it. Oh, no! Oh, no, I almost hit that pillar. And it made me mess everything else up. Oh, wait, we should probably hippie jump into this. Trick of the episode. You gotta try to incorporate the trick of the episode into the episode. Into the challenges, or else what's the point of having a trick of the episode? There we go. Hope I smack my face on that. I don't know if we're gonna be able to hippie jump into this. Oh, maybe. Nope. Oh my gosh, we're definitely not going to get to a million board sales at this rate. There we go. Alright, let's try not to hit anything. There's the one foot. Okay, I hit one of the top things. I'm trying to hippie jump. Keep it. Okay, I guess that was a hippie jump. Oh my gosh. Okay, <laughs> that's enough. That's enough hippie jumping. Let's just try to land the trick now. I know how to 360. No problem. And I know how to one foot. No problem. Oh my gosh, I keep running into that ceiling pit. What do you even call that? Like a... Oh, I can't even think of what it's called. You know what it's called. Boom. Easy money. Killed it. Good work. That's a really cool looking trick. I've seen that a few times in some uh, real life YouTube videos. The 360 one foot stuff. It's pretty cool. It, it looks really steezy. I like it. I dig it. Uh, what picture should we get? Maybe one at the very start? No, probably just one somewhere through the middle. Like right there would be good. I guess the depth of field doesn't really make much sense when we're in a cave. A little bit of saturation. Got to kind of show where we are, you know? There we go. I take the photo very seriously, if you didn't know. <laughs> it just looks like I'm floating. Yeah, good enough, I guess. Well, there we go. 10,000 board sales. We are... Oh, wait, that was 12,000 something, right? 12,500 because we killed it. Ooh, man, we're getting really close to a million. I'm feeling it now. You can definitely get a million board sales in one day, if you really, like, wanted to. So it's not like a million is like some crazy number. It's just something that I thought made sense for a series like this. So I don't I don't think that one million is like the ultimate achievement. I just think that one million is like, you know, it's that number. It's the one million. It's the number. You know, it's a cool number. So we're almost there. We're almost there. Let's try to do a hippie jump somewhere cool. It's kind of hard to think of hippie jump spots that aren't just like doing hippie jump 180s. There's a star up here that I want to find. Oh. Go. Someone told me that you don't have to hold, you don't have to keep tapping A to sprint. So I'm gonna take that advice to heart. Is that true though? I guess it is true. All right. How do I get up here though? This way? Oh, I see the stars right here. Okay. Who's who's the pro we have to play right now? Ooh, Lizard King. Okay. I feel that. What do we have to do? We just have to stay within 150 feet of him, and we get 7,500 board sales. Not too bad. This will actually be a good way to integrate some hippie jumps. Cause I can probably just hippie jump as I follow him. I don't know if that's going to make me lose. What do we have to do? We just stay within 150 feet. Watch me hippie jump and mess up the very first trick. Beautiful. 
Alright, you're going a little slow for me there. Hippie jump. Hippie jump in all directions. Hippie jumps for days. Uh-oh, now we're going down switch. Oh, what in the world? We definitely had to land on that. Okay. I didn't know that, to be fair. To be fair, that wasn't very fair. I didn't know that we had to land on that thing. That's probably why there was the warning at the beginning that was like, Hey, watch out. It's okay. I got it this time. We just need to land on that ramp down there or else we will literally die in many pieces. Ugh. I'm really trying to keep the hippie jumps a part of this episode, but it's pretty difficult. This is not an easy trick of the episode. Now we're going down switch, and I need to land on this ramp or else I'll die. Nice. Get back into Goofy real quick. All right. Wait, what? Was that it? That was the easiest challenge I've ever done. Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, what? That was sick. A foot plant on that would be awesome. Why did? Why was there just like a cutscene right there? Didn't really make any sense, but it was cool still. I dig it. I dig it. Oh, can I do a big hippie jump right here? Alright, that wasn't really that big of a hippie jump. Let's see, where are we going? Where are you going? Why does this guy never miss a trick? Alright, there we go. We stayed within 150 feet. We owned it. Wait, how did we... I guess that one's not possible to kill. That's okay. They're not all possible to kill. Oh, we unlocked a character. Dear Man of Dark Woods. That was a pretty creepy character, but, you know, I'm down for any character. Oh, wait, did it just take me to another... Can I just do another one? I don't know if I want to just... Oh, wait, this is a film. Okay, I was going to say, I don't really want to follow someone again. To own it, grind the rail, grind the ledge, or crooked grind the rail. Shove it and grind the ledge. Fakey kickflip to gap. I don't think I'm going to remember all those. Crooked grind, shove it, fakey kickflip. I could probably do that. I'm not very good at fakey tricks, but I'll do my best. What up? You already know we're rolling up. Ooh, Terry Kennedy from Supra. I feel that. What are we doing? Having some fun, I hope. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Let's just figure it out. We have to do a crooked grind first, and then we have to do a shove it into a grind, and then we have to fakey kickflip. When you try to crooked grind, but you nose grind. Okay, I'll nolly heal out. And then we need to shove it into this. That was a front shove it. Okay, I messed up both of those tricks. Let's restart. I'm gonna let him go first. Go. All right, we need to crook this, which is not as easy as it sounds. Oh my gosh, when he very ill, he'll flip into a board slide. <laughs> I'm gonna go in front of him. He takes too long. There we go, that's a crook. What? It's only giving me nose grinds. The game's not even letting me crook. There we go, there's the crook. Can we make it all the way? Nolly heal out. There we go. Alright, what do I need to do? I need to shove it this sledge. Nice! I didn't actually think I'd get that. Alright, now we just need to fakey kickflip this gap. Oh no, when you fakey heel flip because you're an idiot! It didn't even count. It didn't even count. Gap. Ah, I was like backwards. I was like, which way do I have to flick my finger? I couldn't figure it out, but we're good now. We're good. Just the other way. As long as I can get into this crook again. I'm not very good at any sort of grinds. That's definitely the hardest thing. That was something that was very obvious when I went to make videos with Braille. But I have no idea how to grind in this game. It's just hard. Like, watch this. I'm going to miss this. Never mind. Perfect 5-0. Alright. Gap out to either stair rail. Okay. Oh my gosh. I went into the, I went into the crouch position too early, clearly. Alright, we'll let him go first. Please. Alright, there we go. Backside crooked, no problem. And Nolly heal. Oh no, nope. Nolly front shove it out. You know you can't you can't always get the tricks you want. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hold on. I'm just gonna back up. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna reset. I don't wanna have to do that first trick again. Let's just try to do this. Shove it a little bit cleaner. <laughs> well, not even cleaner. Let's actually just do it. And oh, oh my gosh. It's hard to get up onto that rail or that ledge. I always say rail. Why do I always say rail when I mean ledge? And when I mean when I'm trying to say rail, I always say rail. But oh my gosh. I'm messing up so bad right now. You know, everyone has their days. Everyone struggles to pop, shove it to grind every now and then. There we go. Locks on for me, nice and nice and clean. All right, here we go. Oh, what? That didn't even count. Gap out to either stair rail. Oh, I need to hit the rail. You guys probably knew that and probably thought I was an idiot this whole time. I was like, why isn't this gap counting? I'm like, that's a pretty decent gap. Oh, when you accidentally nose slide. All right, here we go. Oh, when you accidentally nose grind. It's so hard to get into a crook. You have to go at like a, a really weird angle. Oh my gosh. I've never been able to feeble in my entire life and I just did one on accident. There we go. Nope, that's not it either. I'm trying to get around him because I know he takes forever, but then I have to rush my trick. There we go. There's the crooked grind. 
Molly heal out. Beautifully done. Let's just get this. Shove it onto the rail. Beautifully done. Heal flip out. All right, this is actually going to be a little bit harder than I thought. We're going to have to kick flip to a rail. Please. Yes. Yes. That was epic. Oh, it didn't give it to me. What did I mess up? I thought I did everything. I did the crook. And then I did the shove it to grind. Did I accidentally heal flip again? When it's backwards, it's really hard to figure out what to do. Let's let's see. Let's see. I couldn't tell from that angle, but I'm pretty sure I kick flipped. That's okay. I'm pretty sure I did everything right. Let me know in the comments what I did wrong. I actually do read the comments. <laughs> I'd love to love to know what I did wrong. I thought I had it though. Anyways. It looks like there's another photo op up here. Maybe I can do a, a hippie jump photo. It's kind of hard to just hippie jump creatively, I feel like. Maybe not in real life. In real life, you can probably do some fun stuff. In this game, it's hard at least. I haven't found like any rails to hippie jump. That's the problem. I need to find some riggedy riggedy rails. All right, we got a photo op right here. Dozer grind. We're going to have to grind the bulldozer. Or we can tail slide late flip out. I'll try that. I'm really bad at tail slides. Tail slides are easily my worst slide. Yep. <laughs> yep. What if I got that first try? Alright, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Line it up. Oh my gosh. How do people tail slide, dude? In this game. It's just so difficult. Oh, I gotta I gotta Ollie. I can't can't do a fancy trick. It won't give me enough time. Oh Tail slide. This is a tough one. Should I go at it at more of like an angle? What is the problem? Let's try to... I think I can do the other side. Maybe the other side will be easier for me. Almost. Actually, maybe that might help a little bit. We'll try that. Let's also slow down a little bit. Oh, that was pretty close. Okay, can I set my marker like here? There we go. Alright, and then I can just... Uh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe backside isn't easier. I thought it would be though. Oh, I thought that was it. Okay, let's try to front side it again. Tail slide is just a really hard trick in general. Like, what am I even doing? I don't even know how to play this game. Okay, here we go. Tail slide. Oh, that was it if I didn't heal flip. What am I doing? I don't even try to heal flip. It's the sad part. It just happens on accident. Oh, okay. We have 5-0. No! It counted it because all I, all I needed to do was grind it. And because I didn't get the tail slide, all I counted... That was... That was a tail slide. Let's be on. Let's be honest. Okay, you're. T oh my god, my wheel. My wheel is like ever so barely. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was base. I'm tilted right now. I'm tilted towers right now, guys. No joke. All right, let's zoom out. This is actually pretty cool because it's on a bulldozer. Boom. That's a picture right there. That's actually a sweet picture. All right. Well, you know. I really wanted to tail slide that one. I still kind of want to. I'll be honest. Oh, we're getting kind of close to a million. Maybe I want to. Maybe I want to take a million to one more episode. And <laughs> maybe I'll just spend the rest of this episode trying to tail slide this. All right, I'm gonna give it three tries. That's it. Just three tries. And if I don't get it after three tries, it is what it is. I'm not even doing it for the board sales at this point. I just want to try to. Okay, that didn't count as a try. <laughs> that didn't count, guys. Okay, give me a break. Oh, okay. That's one try. If I don't get it, I don't get it. That's it. Two more tries. Oh my gosh. I always heal flip under flip. All right, last try. If I don't get it here, it's fine. Oh, okay. You know what? We're going to have to come back to this one day. That's a trick. I am very bad at tail slides, and that is the absolute truth. One day, though. One day, I'll be good at them. Let's see if I can do it right here. Not, I can't even do it. I do a back lip instead. Oh, well. There's a hollow meat challenge up here. Maybe we can get to it. Oh, we probably, you probably have to go through this to do it. I want to find a rail. At least one. I got to hippie jump one rail at least. Let's just do that really quickly. Because I can't really count this as a trick of the episode if I don't do like something semi-cool with it. There we go. That was kind of cool. Okay. Let's go find this spot up here. I don't exactly know what this spot is, but... Well, it's actually kind of like we let's let's just teleport to it because I don't I don't know how long this episode has gone on so far, but I'm pretty sure I can finally f or not finally I can probably find where I think it's tumbleweed, right? Uh, or it's the stunt man. Uh, wait, Rocky? It might be this one. 
Bail for 12 seconds. We'll just do this one no matter what it does. If it's not in the right place, then... Oh, well. Then we... Oh, okay. This is the right one. Perfect. Good work. I think we just need a bail for 7 seconds, right? Let's see if there's some kill it objectives. We can probably kill it pretty easily. Bail for 18 seconds. Okay. We need a bail for 18 seconds, and then we kill this challenge. And I would be pretty happy with that. Hippie jump off of it. Nice. Well, is it, is, does it count as a hippie jump if you don't land back on the board? Let me know down in the comments. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. This is very bad. I'm not going anywhere near 18 seconds right now. Does a slow-mo count as time? I'm only at 8 seconds right now. This is the longest 18 seconds on YouTube. Oh, my gosh. We got to 15.35. That's actually tough. We might just have... I don't know. Do we want to try to kill it? I feel like we can probably kill it, which is why I want to try. <laughs> just start with the hippie jump. Okay, will it give me a challenge recap and let me retry it? Yeah, let's retry it. I think I can get to 18. 18's a long time, but I, I believe in myself. That's all you need to do to achieve anything in life. Most of the time. <laughs> There's some exceptions. Oh no, I just fell right here. Are you kidding? Okay, let's restart. <laughs> let's restart. You need to fall in a good place. Oh, what if I spread eagle? I don't know why I didn't even think of that. I should just spread eagle as long as I can. And then I should probably be good after that. Okay, and then roll down into here. Nice, nice, and then keep rolling here. Okay, okay, I'm not gonna look at the time. I'm just gonna try to extend this as long as possible. Come on, one more, one more push, buddy. One more push, buddy, you can do it. One more push, buddy, you can do it. Seven, yes, okay, I looked at the time. 19.38, that's a kill challenge. Oof, can you oof and dab on him? All right, that's, that's what I needed. I needed those extra couple board sales. We don't really need to watch this again. I'm pretty sure we didn't get to a million or else it would have been like a million board sales. Oh, on the bright side, we unlocked Dem Bones. Nice. We actually unlocked Dem Bones, one of my favorite characters to play as. All right, well, we're not at a million board sales. I'm not going to check what we're at. I know we're not we're not at a million though, but we'll check next episode. So, on that note, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed another fantastically fun episode of Road to a Million Board Sales. Next episode, we'll probably hit a million board sales. So, tune in next episode which will be in two days or one it'll they're uploaded every other day you get you you get what i'm saying anyways thank you guys for watching and as always stay sexy see you guys